And straight now to Adamawa State. Following the incessant clashes between farmers and herders in Newman Federation, a group known as Documentation of Mass Atrocities, Pinidab Watie, says it is determined to bring to an end the crisis by bringing the two bodies together. The group said that a reconciliation meeting will cut across the seven local government areas of Adamawa State where the critical issues will be looked into and solutions will be proffered as a matter of urgency. The project manager documentation of mass atrocities, Pene Da Boatie, Lofty Dahula said the gathering is timely as it will go a long way in curbing the incessant clashes between two bodies which were known to live in peace and harmony. The essence of this gathering is called community-based town hall meeting. We brought together the different stakeholders from the side of the farmers and the side of the others that are affected by farmers and others conflict in Numan local government in particular. Now some of the representatives of the two bodies load the steps promising to work together towards establishing peace and harmony in Newman Federation. The gathering is very good. Uh, you see, uh, in most cases, if there is a problem between you and a neighbor or a brother, there should be a settlement. There is no fight that cannot have an end, no. I feel, personally, I feel the government is slow about what happened because it is the government that can step in and bring down every issue. He appreciates the group for bringing them together and appealed to both the farmers and herders to embrace each other and leave as brothers. He however disclosed that whoever is found disrupting the peace of the land should be arrested and charged to court for disrupting the peace of the people. Now talking health, 